Hello and welcome back, I'm Aruba. Thank you for joining me, let's play some more of our campaign in EU4. This is Granadan Grandeur. I, uh, just sent some of my ships that were protecting trade in Rhone over to Catalonia. It's looking at some of the numbers in the, uh, trade interface here, and it looks like Catalonia's got far, far more wealth, about double the wealth of Rhone, and we had 64% there versus 57% here. I think it's gonna make us a little bit of cash. So we're making 31 ducats a month in trade, let's see what we do next month. Mark is 31. Hopefully it's superior. I guess I'll start focusing on some trade type stuff here because I don't actually have any anything to I can't declare any wars. Mine complex is complete. Yay, workshop. Mine complex. Mine complex. And an art corporation. And we don't care about that. 31 was the mark. We are now making 30.47. Okay, so that was not as good. I sent a few too many ships. I sent 75% of the ships that were in Rhone, which is a bit excessive apparently. So let's uh Let's take some of them back to Rhone. And we'll see how we do next month. You know what? Before these guys can catch me, um, I think I'm going to go ahead and start my, my truce timer now on these guys. Uh, I'm going to stop building a spy network on you. We're going to kick you out now. We got enough that we can build a spy, uh, get a claim on him. So we're going to break vassalization. Ooh, 25 prestige. Yuck. We'll also lose any cores and claims we have on their provinces. That's fine because we're going to get a new, a fresh claim. 25 prestige shit, kind of stinks, but, you know, I need this province anyway, so. And I've got to wait till next month, but with the 49 spy network strength here. Do you actually have the ability to join a coalition? No, he's got no aggressive expansion, good. See, that's that's what I was worried about, is that they were just going to do that. Incorporate Leon, improve the defenses of some place. Gain some army tradition, gain a level 1 skill half price support guy. I might try that. I want this. We currently have a, a level 1 fort. How much would it actually cost to build a, a better one? Only 200 ducats. It's not too bad. And we can cover most of the cost with some, some bodies. Yeah, I like that. Let's take that mission. A Protestant in lands. Religion changes. Cool. Okay, we get our claim on Morocco. That'll allow us to do that thing. And how close are we then to being able to do this decision? To restore the... We're gonna do one of them. I forget which one now. We just need Tunis and Fez. And Tunis was... That's the little guy right there. We're gonna take in the next war. And Fez we will take whenever our truce is up. And we are no longer in Regency. Our truce with you expires. Look at what my flag looks like. Where is it? 87. Okay, so that was more than 10 years. Or more than 5 years, but less than 10. Hmm. Whatever. Good enough. I'm assuming our prestige is still trending down, so that was a pretty costly hit. We use that. Alright, let's, uh, let's go speed 4 for now. Chaos in neighboring country. The chaos that has engulfed our neighbors. Our neighbor is slowly creeping closer to our own borders. You would think that they would be able to handle their own petty problems, but apparently that is not the case. Should we try to help them? Who? What now? Brittany. I don't care about Brittany. I can gain... Secure our own borders and send aid. So lose 30 ducats, gain war exhaustion, and Brittany gains those ducats, and then they like us better. We gain prestige. Or we could just say no and risk losing stab. Alright, fine. I'd rather just lose the 30 ducats. I mean, I don't care too much about Brittany, but... The prestige is okay. I was just at war with... <laughs> I was the cause of your problems, you know. I'm not sure if you're aware of this. No real progress with the, uh... The coalition, so I'm gonna go down to about 50% maintenance. A policy of tolerance has expired. Okay, and this will be complete August. Here goes our truce with the Turks. Turks, I don't think, are going to be able to join a coalition. They are completely unconcerned with my, my conquest of the Catholics. The plague cometh! At first we thought perhaps it was mere rumor. God help us. Well, let's, uh, let's see if we can identify where this plague has started. 
What do we got? Anything jumping out? Yep. Uh, well, that's a famine. That's not the plague. I think the Turks are having some issues. There we go. I see severe plague here. Okay. Is that this? This must be the initial starting location, right? Because it just spawned, and that's the only one I could find. Severe. It's not devastating. It's just severe. So that's a good. It's a little bit weaker than it could have started. Do we want to do any plague measures? We're ahead of time on Dipple Points. We could try. We could try closing. Let's let's talk to the burgers and see if they'll just do it. The burgers capitulate to your desire to close the ports, but they will. But they will will cooperate without excessive resistance. They will will. See, I don't understand. Like, did that mean that they did it or that they were just. Hmm, whatever. I don't know. No. Okay, the estate understands the crisis in your nation is in, and because they are cooperative, this action will incur no cost. Got it! Okay, okay, okay. So I guess maybe I had to just, like, go in here. What about this other one? Oh, okay. Closing the ports is no, but the other one is they're willing to, they're willing to, to restrict trade. Well, yeah, restrict trade. All centers of trade will have their bonuses negated for five years, however, their susceptibility to plague will be reduced. Yeah, let's do that. I think restricting trade is just... It, we gotta, you gotta protect the peasants, man! That is just so much money. I don't care about the peasants that much. You crazy? Alright, the position has once again become vacant. Now the Sultan must choose a new one. Alright, what do we currently have? We had Loyal. Okay, Loyal, Controversial Theologian. I'll go just lear learned scholar. We like education in our country. We we train all the people stuff. We teach them how to like think good. Use their words, yo. <laughs> That's how we do it in Granada. So controversial religious head. Hmm. That's fine. Apparently I've accidentally not had my ships protect trade. That seems to happen. Losing some money in trade income, and I'm thinking that's probably... Probably not related to what I just did, like moving ships around. That's probably more likely to be related to the huge amounts of death that are happening due to the plague and the famines and stuff. Um, populations dying drastically reduces production of goods, and that affects trade. So, not surprising, really. There's 19.97 ducats in Egypt. And we could actually steer here now and send it to A Aegean or Sicily. This is the... Again, Sicily is going to be here. Sicily can steer into Rhone, which... or Catalonia. Once it gets to Catalonia, it comes to us. Maybe we can start trying to work into this node, but... It's pretty difficult without having any actual provincial trade power. Also, it looks like it's quite, quite likely that that one ship trying to repair may have... prevented all of these ships from providing trade power last month. Yep, trade power from light ships, none. Well, how about you let the one ship repair and then everyone else get back to work? 
room for quite a few more boats. Was I waiting for new tech? Tech 30 for the next light ship. So that's going to be a big no. I remember selling my transports recently, and we have new tra new transport tech coming up soon. Let's build two more ships and just sell the other weaker ships to somebody else. You'll buy them for the sum of none. Okay, Aragon, do you want to buy some ships? They're bankrupt. My ally is bankrupt. How did I miss that? Hmm. Oh, that's right. Everyone hates me. <laughs> Oops. Forgot about that. It's probably, probably unlikely that anyone's going to buy these ships at a fair price, isn't it? Except for maybe Aragon. Mamluk, hey, you know, you might buy these ships. They are in debt. My god, no one has any cash. And everyone else hates me. Fine, I guess... I guess we're just gonna have to get rid of those ships. I'm not gonna think about it anymore, it's too much work. The Storm of 1482. A storm has ravaged our, our provinces, leading to huge floods, laying waste to our provinces close to the coast. That's not good! I just built a bunch of ships! <laughs> I was trying to... Not... No! Stop it! Christianity is in decline. It was one of the cores that finished here. Yes, good. University, please. 500 ducats. Alright. In two years, we can start spreading that renaissance quite a bit faster. We will definitely take this tech now. And I'm kind of tempted to take Diplotech ahead of time again. Highway Network. Ooh, it's the third tier of road. Wow, that's kind of shockingly early in the game that you get access to the third tier. There's only four tiers, right? Yeah. Road and railway network. We're apparently going to build roads, like railway, in the year 1500. Hmm. Well, the thing is, I don't really need it yet. I'm not going to be building those roads just yet. They will be very upset. <laughs> of course they will. Hey, now we're making 32.6. That's decent. More than we saw... A little while ago. It's kind of fluctuating wildly. I usually find, uh, depending on the value, you've kind of got to sort of slant it toward whichever node has more trade value, but like, if this one has, if let's say both these two nodes have more trade power, like equal trade power, then you want to have roughly equal, like 70% control and 70% control would be ideal. Seems to be a pretty good measure to go by, but people have created Massive spreadsheets. Try to calculate trade. Civil War in Bohemia. Remember when Bohemia was in a personal union under uh, Austria for a while? Look at that plague. Hold on, I gotta, I gotta take a look at this. So the plague has spread to a lot of places. None of which is our land. Thank you, burgers, for being understanding and, and closing those damn ports. We've got... Okay, hold on, we do have a little bit of plague. Moderate plague. And over here, not looking so great. They've, they've got the they've got the plague pretty bad, severe. Catholic Church, I will give them support. Your opinion of me is very low. We're still allies, though. Normally, you go below fifty, and they like break the alliance right away. So you have subsidies from me. You. Are maxed out nearly on improved relations. 80 79 aggressive expansion. 
little bit of border friction. I guess you want some provinces that I that I have. Uh, let's see. What do you What do you want? He wants this land here. Okay, so the issue is he's got claims on what used to be Castilian territory. He's got claims on my province of Provenza. He does not desire much. He's he's always been this diplomatic and kind a of passive country. Very easy to deal with, it seems. Okay, our court is declining. We need to stay above 45. Education, I think, is probably still on the rise. Now Poland has a personal union. Man, Bohemia has just passed around like a... Oh, I don't even want to make the joke. It's just it's inappropriate. <laughs> our education is increasing. Uh, let's see, we're at a nice multiplier. It's getting higher. Good. More universities would be nice. Wait, how close was that number? We have four studying abroad, 28 still without a university to, to go to. Just need to keep on building those damn universities, like everywhere. I don't really want to increase funding. Alright. Should we ditch these other relationships or should we just keep them? I, I didn't. I forgot. Okay. It's zero stab because we've got full diplomacy, but I forgot about the 25 prestige shit. I mean, I'll, I mean, it's only eight eight years for these other guys. I think we'll hold on to these ones for now. Yeah, let's let's just not worry about those ones. Morocco, I wanted to do because it is probably faster. We'll top off relations with the ones that we have. Um, um, I really like the music in this mod. I've been playing it enough that it feels feels normal to me now. It feels like it's part part of the base game. It's gonna be hard to go on back to not having any of it. Man, those Turks, they are always at war. This mod does a great job at making the AI more aggressive. A Muscovy, Lithuania, Turkish Empire. You remember Turks started off so tiny. The Pope has excommunicated France. What is this occupation here? French peasants. Negative three stab, negative 66 prestige. And we have a new university in Burgos. Did I build that one? I know I started one a year ago, but I don't I think I started one two years ago. So it looks like maybe the burgers are helping out. Let's check out Burgos. No, I, I think I did build that one, didn't I? The plague has passed over. Oh damn, we are getting the plague. It's it's very mild. But it's it's coming into our lands. The plague has ceased before it could reach this province. However, should a fresh wave of wave of plague arrive from a different direction, it may reignite plague in this province. Oh, it ceased before it could reach. So these this is like the barrier then for the plague. So how did it go up in this way? Stop it! Stop the plague! I'm not a big fan of this whole... Still being over the land force limit up. That's a lot of penalty. 4.41 ducats? Maybe yeah, I should get rid of some of these troops. I mean, for four ducats a month, in 12 months, I'm going to spend, what, like 50 ducats. I could easily build something else. It feels foolish to be over it by this much. All 
All right, cool. Well, I'm going to put in a cut here. I'll be back in the next episode, though. As always, I hope you guys are enjoying the camp uh, campaign. Capital, capital building maintenance. Yes, we get that pop up every year. But I'll, uh, I'll be back same time, same place later on. Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon. See you in a bit.